It has been over 2,000 years since Jesus Christ made a promise to his disciples. This promise is found in John chapter 14, verse 1 to 3, right where Jesus promised that he will go to heaven and he will prepare a place and he will come again. From the church of the apostolic times to the church of the Middle Ages, down to our time, we have been teaching, we have been preaching, Jesus is coming back. Right, and in today, in this video, we will be looking at the signs or the circumstances or the events surrounding the second coming of Jesus Christ. According to Revelation 1 verse 7 and Matthew 26 verse 64, those persons who had a major role to play in the crucifixion of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, these persons will be resurrected just before the second advent of our Lord and our Savior Jesus Christ. So we're talking men like Pilate, Caiaphas, Ananias, the Sanhedrin, Right? Those soldiers who draw, drove the nails into Christ's hands and into Christ's feet. All these persons will be resurrected just before Christ put in his appearance the second time. Right? And why would God do such a thing? Is to show them that the man that they had denied and cursed and misused was actually the Son of God, the Christ. Psalms 104 verse 3 says this, Who lay the beams of his chambers in the waters, who make it the clouds his chariot. So according to the scriptures, God's chariot is his clouds. According to Psalms 68 verse 17, right, the scripture says that the chariot, right, are actually angels, right, right there on the screen. That's what it says.